Good morning folks, it's Steve here, and it looks like we're not going to be into the website today, so we're going to do things uh, a little bit differently. Your first task, you've got a uh, email from me, and you'll see a link that says Special Education in Ontario. If you click on that, it's going to take you to a, a presentation, also called Special Education in Ontario. And this is, this is inside a... Uh, inside a... Um, a Google presentation, but it's a lot like uh, it's a lot like a uh, PowerPoint. Okay, so if you see up here, um, you've got a view button that so I can just click and I can hit present, and I can just now get the presentation. I can start to just flip through here using the down arrow, and I can take a look at uh, the presentation that we've got. Okay, and it goes through for a number of slides. Uh, that takes us through the ideas around special education uh, all the way through to uh, what happened in Ontario in 1980 and the Education Amendment Act uh, and a number of the different rules and regulations. You're going to see a lot of different things with these PPMs here. Um, don't be too concerned with with uh, remembering them or memorizing them. They do just speak to the fact that, that uh, occasionally the government does have to add uh, things to uh, the special education act um, and a lot of them around things that just weren't covered the first time or things that are new uh, such as rules around the literacy test which uh, wasn't around in 1980. Okay so if you could just go through this slide to start and uh, take a look at some of the different things that we've got in here. Um, it does lead us up uh, to this case study which you've probably heard about the Eaton versus Brant County Board of Education. You may have uh, had that covered uh, in, your, uh, in your ed degree. Um, but just use it to refresh yourself on uh, on what happens when families and schools don't agree on appropriate placements. Okay, um, so if you can flip through that, and I'll have another assignment out for you uh, later this morning. Okay, take care.